Happy Valentine's Day. Look, did mommy and daddy get you a Valentine's present? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You want to play with that? Are there kisses in there? <laughs> you try to figure out how to open them? Here. Here, I can help you. Oh. Can Mama get a picture of this before I... Before I open it for you, would that be okay? You're not having chocolate right now. Just make sure you get the other piece of paper. Make sure you get this one off. <gasps> oh my goodness. You lucky little duck. You would never get chocolate this early if it wasn't Valentine's. What do you think? Mm. You like it? Should I open this for you? I'm going. Oh. Who is that? As you can see, Hendrix has already dug in, but for our Valentine's Day breakfast, he has a bit of a cinnamon waffle just got a little bit of cinnamon on it and then like i said a little bit of cool whip and a little bit of syrup plum huh? let's see we'll try to swing good job it isn't the prettiest looking but it's gonna taste delicious Whoa. <laughs> somebody found the lid to the whipped cream that feels so cool. Oh my goodness. On a mission this morning to make some healthier snacks for the week so the first one happens to be a really quick five ingredient granola bar there's more than five ingredients here but that's because two of them are optional which would be the salt and cinnamon you turned off my light did you do that oh trouble can you turn it back on on <gasps> Thank you. You're gonna turn it off, aren't you? Yay! But this is what they're supposed to look like once they are finished. So I'm excited to make them and I even have a little helper with me. Do we make some granola bars? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so sweet. Are you ready? Put your hand right here. You're gonna help me dump it. Ready? Good job. Good job, baby. I'm actually really impressed. She get in there. Shake, 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 shake. Close the lid. Okay, Mama's gonna need to. Oh, you can put your finger in there. Ooh, taste it. Ooh, what do you think of that? Ooh, is it good stuff? Look at those hands. They have peanut butter all over them. I'm going to lick it again. What is that? Is it yummy? I'm going to take that as a yes. His first time playing in the snow. <gasps> it's like it's stuck to my glove. <gasps> Whoa. 
You just want to walk in it? You're not going to grab it? Woo! Have kisses? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good job! That's new. Can I have kisses? Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> You're cute. This morning, we are headed out to breakfast. Simply for the fact that our apartment is a mess and I don't even know which mess to show because there's this one, this one, and this one. Are you hungry? Do you want some food? Do you know what you want? You don't know what you want? What? Do you want a drink? Are you thirsty? Okay, let's go get you a drink. We can get you some juice or something to bring with you. There. Good job! Yay! Oh, what are you looking for? For this? You gonna put them away? Kind of a tight squeeze, huh? Good job! Did you sleep good? Mm. <laughs> Did you kick mama out of bed? It's like making me rub his leg. It's okay, huh? Good official morning, you guys. We are on our way to the battle zone. They have like a little toddler session, I guess, if you will. I've never heard of it, I've never been to it, so I'm interested to see what it's all about. So we are heading out the door to go do that. <laughs> I just wanted to pop in and kind of explain why this video is kind of all over the place why it's like a month's worth of footage but before I get into that I wanted to quickly mention that sorry for the lack of footage at battle zone we got there kind of late because they stopped doing the toddler time at like 1 I think and we got there at 12 and the first half hour Hendrix was just crying and would not leave my side Which I can't really blame him because there were a lot of tall and big bouncy houses which can be very overwhelming for like a little toddler so I was just trying to comfort him we finally got him into something that he enjoyed which obviously was that car he seriously loved that thing he played with that for like the full half hour I definitely want to bring him back there he seemed to really enjoy himself pretty much the reason why I haven't been posting so much is just because there's been so much going on in my life and I'm not gonna put much of it out on YouTube just because there are things that just don't need to be put out on social media like for instance my mom's health has gone downhill a lot of you guys probably know if you watch our vlogs that every I want to say like four or six months I can't really remember we go to Utah for my mom's doctor's appointments and it's because she has an illness called AS and it's ankylosis spondylitis I can never say it it's kind of a hard one to say basically when you google it it's just going to tell you like oh this person's spine is going to fuse together um but unfortunately, in my mom's case, and really it's a little like this for a lot of the people that are diagnosed with this, um, it's much more than that. I've always seen her struggle with her health, but I feel like this past month or two, it has really hit her hard. Um, she's had to have surgery 
probably just a couple weeks ago, I believe it was. Yeah, it was probably two weeks ago. Um, because she was having some complications with things. She's having problems with her liver, her kidneys. She's in pain all the time in her joints. She has to get infusions just like a cancer patient would. The infusion that she gets is a form of radiation to help not cure what she has but to help slow it down basically and it's honestly been one of the hardest things to watch my mom go through so yeah my mom hasn't been doing very well so I've kind of been focusing on that and obviously worrying about her because she's my mom I have been wanting to do a life update for quite a while now but I don't know that I'm ready to you know there's still a lot that I'm trying to heal from I guess if you will so it might be a while, but I will tell you that I'm still living in the same apartment and we have been here for one year officially. We just renewed our lease. We were going to move out, but after like writing down the pros and cons, it was better if we were to stay in this apartment. It's not the prettiest apartment, but it's a roof over Hendrix's head and that's really all that matters. I'm sorry if this was all over the place, but there's just so much that I wish I could just sit down and like tell you guys and talk to you but unfortunately it's not always like that so thank you guys for watching and i will see you very soon bye guys